What's going on? This is Legend of All About the Kick. Subscribe to the channel. Put a like on that button. We talk about Tank Davis, man. He got in a car accident in 2020. Um, a hit and run. He left the scene. Um, it's going to be tough. I don't know. He got this boxing match coming up real soon. They haven't set a date yet. But he's supposed to go to trial. Not trial. But he's supposed to go to court December 12th. Um, just hope this don't mess up the, the uh, boxing thing that goes going to go on this basically next year. Um, I don't know why would you leave a scene. You got four people that got hurt. I know he tried to do like a like a plea deal or whatever, but you know the, the judge said no. You go on the trial. So I mean, I'm not saying he's gonna get time, but he's definitely gonna have to pay some money. I mean, you got insurance. I don't, you know, you make you making a millions of dollars. So why would you leave the scene? You know, that's kind of wrong. You know, four people got serious, serious hurt. So, like, I don't understand these people, man. Like, if I can see if you didn't have no insurance or maybe you was drinking and driving. I don't know. But, you know, they they must have got his license plate number off the cameras or somebody wrote it down. And, you know, he got to go to trial. He got he got a court date. Um, just pray that, you know, it don't mess up the bots and match that he's supposed to have. Because um, we do want to see it. And, um, I don't know. You got to be careful when you... You hit somebody, just stay, man. I know a lot of people who don't have insurance, they, they definitely will run. That's why I always get nervous when somebody hit my car because you don't know who got insurance. You know what I'm saying? If somebody hit and run, who got time? You might get hurt trying to chase the person or whatever. So you got to be real careful out here. But you got millions of dollars. You should just stay. I mean, I can see if you didn't have no money and you didn't have no insurance or registration. Then you can just say, like, okay, let me run. Here we go. Mayweather <laughs> You know, Mayweather spent a lot of money, man. He spends a lot of millions and millions of dollars on watches and clothes and on, Ju you know, Gucci. I mean, the dude spends a lot of money. He got different cars. He got his own stuff. I mean, he, I don't really think he need the money. But um, he's doing another fight, man. He's doing the best mission fight. Um, he got two fights coming up. I think he's saying he only he only taking $20 million or $40 million for these fights. So, I mean, Mayweather, it's good to see Mayweather back in the boxing, ma you know, match. Would this mess up his legacy? I mean, no, nah, I don't think it mess up his legacy. But, I mean, I think you should just sit your ass down and just collect your money and just keep on finding boxers and train them and get them right. Um, you never know. Somebody might just knock Mayweather out, man. You know, he's getting old. You know, I think he's, what, 44 now? But, you know, somebody could knock you out in an exhibition fight. I mean, be a C, man. I mean... I mean, if you're going to make easy money, why not do it? You know what I'm saying? People want to see Mayweather anyway. He's entertaining. So, I mean, one of the greatest boxers of all time. You know what I'm saying? Um, deny that. The best defense of all time. Him and Muhammad Ali had the best defense to me and Sugar Ray. Um, so, you can't deny that. You can't deny, you know, he is 50-0. and 0. But, I mean, for I mean, if I, could, if I could do an exhibition fight, I would do it too. For, you know, $20, $40 million, why not? And people going to watch it, why not? You know, Mayweather, salute to you. Keep getting that money. Um, next topic. Let's go. Let's talk about Wack 100. Uh, he's a clown, man. You know, Wack 100. You know, I like Wack 100. Don't get me wrong. I mean, the dude can fight. You know, he is a, you know, he is a gangster. You know what I'm saying? I can't deny that shit. You know, what's for him? The game. Who know the hell he'd be at? But he is a cheater, man. He cheated on his wife. He said his him and his wife was unacceptable. Like, you know, he loved his wife. He'd been with her for all these years. But he flying chicks in. He's giving them private motels and all type of shit. I mean, you can't be out here talking about um, everybody else and you doing all kinds of warm things yourself, man. You can't say you love your wife and you cheating on your wife, man. You know what I'm saying? If your wife gives you a pass to do what you do, allegedly... I'm just going to say allegedly, you know what I'm saying? You know, you could do it. But you talk about you love your wife, y'all inseparable, y'all body and Clyde. But you flying these chicks in and you giving them motels and giving them all the good stuff. Um, you just be doing some foo foo stuff sometime, man. And, um, you know, it, it is what it is. But calm down, Wack 100. Calm down, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying you're going to lose your wife because you've been with her for mad years. But, man, stop flying these holes in. You know what I'm saying? Stick to your wife. If she ain't giving you what you need, man, just the forces, man. <laughs> Wack 100. Sometimes you just be doing some clown stuff, man. But, you know, men love vagina. You know, pretty woman come around. <laughs> you know, these niggas out here be barking like hyenas, man. Thanks for watching the channel. Thanks for subscribing to the channel. Please put a like on that button. And uh, if you like the topics I did today, leave a comment. 
and share the video, man. Share the video. We out of here. Wallah. Peace out. Salute to everybody. One.